Hey amigos, check this bad boy out. This knife right here is an example of the power of positive thinking, the law of attraction. You know, I have one of these guys already, but it doesn't have the bail or clevis. It is not in as good shape. I had to dye one of the covers because it was not looking as nice as this guy right here. Um, I bought it, and the one that I have, I think I paid like 30 or 40 bucks for it. But this is in far better condition, guys. So I put out a search. I put out a search because I wanted another one. I wanted a better one. I put out a search, and then I put in there, Case Whaler, eleven ninety nine, right? Because that's the code for this guy. Uh, that's the number, eleven ninety nine SHR. The SH stands for sheep's foot. It's got a sheep's foot blade, right? And the whaler, well, they call him the case whaler, I believe, because this is primarily a rope knife, that it would have a maritime application, right? But the R stands for the clevis right here, which you could attach something to. I've attached this little leather uh, lanyard that I made uh, on it um, just to make it easier to pull out of the pocket. Even though I have a sheath for it, I really like this knife very much. So I put out a search on eBay, and as soon as something popped up, bing, it gave me a notification on my phone. So I checked it, and when I saw the price of $14.99, I jumped on it all day, man, because you know that this knife runs about $75 to 100 bucks in this condition. So when I saw it for $14.99, I thought, oh, man, I'm just going to buy it, and I bought it. And I was thinking, I hope that the seller doesn't get seller's remorse, right? And it was a pawn shop. And I went ahead and I, I purchased it and I waited and I waited and then it said shipped. And I couldn't believe it. I still couldn't believe it all the way up until I received it. And let me tell you, I am not disappointed. Um, this is a beauty of a knife that I paid 15 bucks for. An incredible deal. Those of you that follow all follow me also on my posts uh, saw this knife. And I've already been carrying this knife several times. I like it so much. And you guys know, when I buy a knife, I first, you know, uh, it sits in my toolbox for months and months before I even do a video on it. And uh, I don't carry it until I do a video on it. But on this one, I had to start carrying it and I had to do a video on it because I know I'm going to be carrying it a whole lot more. Um, it wasn't very sharp when I got it. It's got some light scratches in the blade. Doesn't bother me none. Whole blade's there. Uh, I sharpened it up a bit. A few passes with my Easy Lap Diamond Hone and poof, there it is back to sharp and razor. Uh, it was a little bit dirty on the inside, still is. I gave it a little bit of cleaning, nothing major. Um, this is just a great functional knife. Um, it's not going to let you down. This is a 1965 to 1969 model, according to that tank stamp. I believe that tank stamp uh, is from 1965 to 1969. So this guy's older than I am and uh, deserves my respect. And respect it shall have, amigos. Um, I do intend to use it, however, because this is a very useful tool for me. I love the sheep's foot design on this knife. But I just wanted to let you know and remind you, you got to put those searches out on eBay. You got to go look because if you don't go look, you're not going to find it, you know. And when you least expect it, that's when it's going to come out. This thing popped up. This search popped up and it, it kind of gave me a notification on my phone when I was just sitting down and relaxing at the end of the day. Perfect time. I just sitting back down in the recliner. Then bing. I'm like, well, what's this? And I'm like, snap, and I bought it instantly because I knew what this was, and I just had to have it. All right, amigos, I wanted to share my good fortune with you. Uh, I just want to let you guys know I'm getting very close to 3,000. I already had a giveaway recently. Uh, huge, huge congratulations to the winner. And uh, just to let you know, there's more giveaways out there coming out your way. Uh, my next milestone is probably going to be 3,500, uh, which is about 600 uh, or so uh, subscribers from now so that'll be the next giveaway probably around 3,500 unless I do a Christmas giveaway uh, which I like to do sometimes as well all right amigos y'all take care have a blessed blessed week ahead uh, you're more than likely going to see this video today uh, I'm filming this today on a Friday later than I usually post it but I'm going to go ahead and post it because I can't wait for you to see this bad boy up close all right guys take care God bless you my friends